Welcome back to another RMS Support Center tutorial video. Today's topic we're going to be covering how to create a new user account for RMS 3.0. In order to get started we're going to go ahead and click on the black tile here on the login view that says new users to create an account. Click here. At the top we have two text fields. The first one is for our first name and the second one is our last name. Next we're going to go ahead and enter in our email address. Now this email address will be your new user ID for your RMS 3.0 login. Now this is also the email address that you need to give your USACE core representative if you are the very first contractor being added to the contract. That way you can successfully view and enter into the contracts that you need to work on. The next step is to create our own password. Now you can create your very own unique password following the requirements down below or you can use one of our randomly generated passwords between our six examples down at the bottom. To do so, simply click on your, the password you want, hit Control C and Control V on the password boxes at the top. Now, just a little side note, make sure that you save this password in a secure location such as a password manager. Once when you've selected your password, go ahead and click on the button that says Create Account. And so now our account has been created and we can see that by this little pop-up that has appeared here and we're going to go ahead and just click OK on this window. And now we're on the email verification view. This is the view where we have to enter in a registration code that has been sent to the email that you have entered when creating your RMS 3.0 account. Now please note that depending on your email service provider that this can take up to a couple of seconds to hours. And once when you've received that email, go ahead and copy the registration code, the entire code, make sure there's no spaces after. Copy it and paste it in the text box above just like this. Then click the button Submit Registration Code. Now that we're on the login view, we can now log in using the credentials that we just created for our new account. To do so, just click on the black tile down at the bottom that says if you do not have a DoD issued smart card, click here. Then enter in your username at the top and your password. You can also click on the remember my user ID checkbox to make sure that you don't have to enter in your username each time that you log into RMS 3.0. And that's how you create a new RMS 3 account. Thanks for watching.